all right sonic superstars is a very good game but it has one huge problem and those are the boss fights in every other sonic game the boss fights were designed to benefit the knowledge of the mechanics so for instance the sonic colors final boss you can complete it in a half the time if you manage the boost gauge correctly because you can boost to get a second hit on him same with the Sonic on these day stage bosses. And even in Sonic Generations, the Egg Dragoon, the Mark II, you can complete it almost half the time again with the ability to dodge attacks at point blank range. In my opinion, that's how it's supposed to be and that's that's how most video games do it as well. Usually, even if it's not designed to benefit the knowledge of the mechanics, it doesn't take an eternity between each opportunity to score a hit. A game that had the same problem was Sonic Rush, but that game was designed with the levels and boss fights separate from each other. So after playing the boss fights once, you didn't have to go back to them whenever you played a level. All you had to do to avoid the boss fights is not selected in the level select. The problem with Sonic Superstars, however, is that the boss fights are baked into the levels. Why would you do that? The boss fights are terrible. And bro, the Fang boss fight in, I don't even know what's called, Golden Capital. Golden Capital Act 2, whoever designed that boss fight needs to serve jail time, bro. That boss fight is straight garbage. You can't do anything with the Emerald Powers, which are there to help you. It's an auto-scroller. It takes a good minute and a half just to hit him once and you're supposed to hit him six times i think or eight times i don't know like bro the game is the game is fun but the boss fights are so bad how could you do this and again i said the emerald powers are meant to mitigate the window of waiting and for some it's it works like the pinball carnival boss fight bridge island act 2 boss fight the one where you're fighting eggman in the death egg for the 4000th time in the sonic series like sometimes it works but there's some like the what's the desert level called sand sanctuary the guy's chilling in the background for 90% of the boss fight. You can't do anything. It doesn't matter if you have bullet. It doesn't matter if you have vine, whatever you have. It doesn't matter. God forbid you turn on slow and it takes four years for him to actually come back on the same plane as you. Like, it's just terrible. The game without the boss fights is an easy A tier. I said this in my ranking video. But with the boss fights, it's, it's, it's almost a B. It's maybe even a high B at the, at the lowest. I have never seen a game other than this and Sonic Rush where the game makes you wait hours to hit the boss once but at least in sonic rush one the music was actually good you weren't listening to complete garbage and secondly once you beat the boss fight and you want to replay a level you don't have to fight the boss because in its own level select whenever i play sonic superstars i quit the level before i get to the boss fight that's how terrible they are and when a game is making you quit the level before the end because there's something that just ruins the whole experience for you it has been designed horribly and once again whoever designed that boss fight for golden capital act 2 needs jail time have a nice day everyone enjoy yourself subscribe if you haven't already